want to know. How late this morning? How late was that? That's 10 minutes. Talk about standards. First, first pre-season? No, first and last time I'm going to be here. <laughs> first and last. How is it catching up? Because did you have to start later? What, the run? Yeah. Um, no, I didn't do the first run. Because like, um, me and Zach, when we got there, we must have ran to some golf course. Like, we were trying to find the lads. We couldn't find them. How, yeah. how are you finding it so far? Yeah, it's good, good. Good pre-season. Different to youth team. But like, it's a good, I like the change. Like, it's more intense and everything. So, yeah, it's good. So you're a little bit further along, I guess, than Harrison and Jeff P. You, kind of, you were here this time last year, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, I was. So you giving them any tips? Um, the boys already know what they need to do. They're both <laughs> all good players, so... Don't set the gaffer. <laughs> yeah, that's the key thing. Don't upset the gaffer. Forest, week two of pre-season. Uh, we start the morning off with a continuous run and then work more interval and then finish off with some hill sprints slash uh, team runs. Uh, a bit of team bonding for week two to start the week off right and then obviously off to Portugal at the end of the week. Yeah, good. Fresh. Nice little drill there. A little bit of team bonding. Tough. This sandy day takes out your legs. Heels tough. No, good though. Good. So that's really last season. <laughs> Finally kept off. How's it going? Not too bad. Alright. First hill we're tough. Feeling fresh? Not bad. Nice and crisp, crisp morning in Hainaut. Beautiful cross country run with the boys. Lovely way to start the week. Yeah. Yeah, it was alright. It was alright. Um, it's just a steady blast, like consistent run we do all together um, at a good pace. And then after we did a few, a bit of a fartlet, so like 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Um, which obviously, when you're 30 seconds on at that point, the tempo is a lot higher. But you get a bit of a rest, which is a walk. I was going to say, has it changed a bit from like your first preseason when they probably just blast you on the first day? Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. I think Gaffer's been very vocal on the fact that, like, when he used to do preseason, he hated it. We weren't a big fan, fan of it. Not that he's took it easy on us, but um, but he's got the balls out. He's tried to make it enjoyable at the same time. So, yeah, it it's definitely has been enjoyable at the same time. Really, really tough. How's the um, obviously been back in London with a daughter and stuff? Now is that a different side of it? A bit tiring on that that side? Yeah, yeah it's, it's tiring, but it's a blessing at the same time. Like I get real quality time, fortunately enough. Um, which has been ledge. I just shared with you, I went to the zoo with her over the weekend, she's absolutely buzzing. And they're memories that probably not everyone would be able to create um, as often I'm allowed to um, during that off season period. So, um, so yeah, and I've really enjoyed it. And being back locally, being around family and friends and sharing those memories with other people, I could be far away and just be doing it for ourselves. Mm. But I get to build these memories with family and friends, which is, which is lovely. You gotta make a few sounds as well. Ah! 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 Ah!
copyright claim for his music in it. Probably. Ah! How was your first week of pre-season? Good. Tough actually. Yeah. Because I had an enjoyable summer. A few beers? Yeah. Sometimes too many. But I'm not I'm not on the fit, so I can play. Feeling good, feeling fresh. Yeah. Ready to so, go? Can't wait. I've been egging for it, egging for it, because what happened last season? I'm just like get me back. Mm. Let me start off strong. Let me finish strong, so fingers crossed they can get kicking. The start of last season, what, what where did that injury come from? Was that just like over exertion or? Um it was just fatigue, mate. It was a build up of me being so fit. And then a bit of force on someone pushing on top of me and my hammy just didn't accept it. Mm. Felt okay. And then came into training the next day and it was just getting worse and worse. And I just tried to continue on training and I went in from training and bent over to do my boots and half goes a weasel and I went went to see. Was out for six weeks and I was just trying to play catch up. Trying to play catch up killed me. Because mm. once I came back, the other hammy went. Came back again, the other hammy went, so it was like just going back and forth. But I'm good, positive good. mind frame, get kicking and have a bit of fun. <laughs> you'd be done after no, no, April, no, no. so? No chance. Huh? After April, you'd be done. Yeah, but did you run? No, you couldn't run. I'm not as good as running as you, but I'll be able to finish a run. No, you wouldn't. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Would you be able to last nine minutes, to be honest? You yeah, have a slow, plodding pace, yeah. Get the ball and offload it. But that's not me, I have to stand in my golf, man. And you can't, the ball comes to you. I'm saying it. Have you ever seen them on the door? I'm like, no, you're playing. Start losses, you didn't move anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you started moving around. <laughs> <laughs> Did I tell them? No, no. <laughs> Did I tell the people about this time here? Or no? Ruel, <laughs> 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 I tell them or not? Go on, tell them. Tell them, tell them. What day was it? First, it was Thursday? twice. Well, there was it Thursday. There was a Monday morning and there was also a big, big Thursday. Big Friday morning. What? Thursday. Where a big Omar Beckles tried to get past me <laughs> and he witnessed the stiff arm. What? The what? The stiff arm? The stiff arm. The stiff arm. I thought it was on Thursday. Yeah, it was, it was on Monday. Here, oh Monday. my god. To the chair. To the chair? I'll go first. I think that's got a chance. I think that gets you a minimum point. You go in. How about you go? Go on, laces, mate. I'm trying to work. Laces! Just don't go on, haven't we? Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh. He'll still give himself points. Luke, shall I, shall I go laces or side foot? Laces. Who's your laces? Started like five yards in front. Man, touching the green slows you down, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, little bubble! Oh! I know! He does that beside you! It's his favouritism! No! Oh, come on! Grace, I love you! Ah! 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 Oh, what a touch that is. Oh, yeah. Great touch. Yeah. 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 Come on! Oh, Chris, that's yeah. you, mate. Tell me that did touch your chin. Is he doing it? Oh, three goes. How many is that? Two. 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 I'm the ref. Oh, oh. Yeah. 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 Yes! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> that's two! But Halo Force 1, that happened nil.
Oh my god, you're so strong. Me too, ain't ready. <laughs> just doing a bit of hamstring testing here at ISO, just looking at 45, see if there's any big differences between left and right, just to try and reduce injuries. Strong. Forest run did warm you up. <laughs> For me, that's not nice. Cheers, For me, Ethan Cole. Yeah, yep. No, I'm not. One, oh, two, three, four, five. It's gone five. gone big on the first one, hasn't he? Five. Four, two, eight. Best one. Last one. Good brown, eh? You can still see it. It's for your armies. It cramped my calf. My technique was wrong. Obviously since Richie has kind of like, it's helped me a lot, given me a lot of confidence as well. So I feel like, yeah, I deserved it. And when the opportunity came, I think I thought I'd done all right as well. I've got like 10 minutes or so. Yeah. But yeah, you just, during that time, you just got to try to express yourself, show, show the fans what you got, show Gaffer what you got as well. What about the... Um the home gate or home debut as well. Was there yeah. a few nerves of that one? Because obviously that's a bit yeah, more significant, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, family came as well. Obviously got a longer run out. So yeah, nerves were definitely there. Obviously I, I, would, I was told that I, would, I was going to play, so at least it gave me a bit of more time to prepare. Yeah. But um, no, it's, it's always good to play, man, especially in front of the home fans, like in front of my family as well. So you just got to embrace moments like that. I thought I'd done all right as well. Had a chance to get an assist. Yeah. Try, try shoot, try <laughs> go for glory, but yeah, we, we live and we learn. How long have I known Zach? Since Zach was an under 16 and I was an under 17. He came from um, Tottenham Hotspur. So, um, yeah, he was on trial here. I didn't know much of him because I was a and he was 16. But yeah, I saw it. We played against him, we played against the under 16s as a 17. Obviously, we smashed him like a 6 1. <laughs> but um, yeah, Zach. Zach stood out that game. He scored as well, scored all he got. And yeah, from there, we just, yeah, just knowing him. And he just happened to live quite close to me, literally en route to the training ground, so. Yes, lads. <laughs> Tell me about that new training. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> I'm getting it, I'm getting it redone, but hey, it's something what, There's no chance of going Portugal. <laughs> hey, bro. Oh, mate. You know what, I'm getting it redone today, so it's alright, yeah. I'll, I'll hold the banner for today. <laughs> We're talking about the quality game, Zach, and blowing a bit, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Um, it's a difference from youth team to first team. Right? The first 20 minutes, I think Gaffer already knew that I was blown already. But he just obviously helped me and said, yeah, just keep going, keep going. And all the boys helped me anyway, so, yeah. yeah. Talking about when uh, PT came over and told you, and like, you just got well quiet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nervous? Um, I, I didn't. I didn't. I don't think I had enough time to be yeah, nervous. Just like, to yeah, it. I was just trying to process it all. And I thought at first, I thought he was having a laugh. <laughs> that when he told me that because PT is a joker, so yeah. I thought he was like that like, having a laugh. But then when when I actually ended up being on the team, show, I was like, yeah, okay, it's happening. Now, so.
Mikey, I actually think you should go in goal, mate. Ready? Straight in. He's got a goal. Are you coming He's in? I'm convinced. <laughs> Go on then, I'm going that side. Hold you. <laughs> yes, Mike. <laughs> Mike, if you save one, I'll give you a fiver. Oh, got to dive, though. You've actually got to attempt to dive, okay? Ah, oh, oh. That was your chance for a five ball. <laughs> no, what have we done? Oh. Hey, love it. Yeah, <laughs> five, six. Five ball. Oh. A little bit more, I didn't think he was actually going to dive for it. Perhaps you're not even, you're just being a bit of a knob though with a shooter. Sorry? You're just being a bit of a putting it right in the corner, not even giving him a oh, chance. I'm just getting one, I need to get out of training, Craig. <laughs> I'm trying to better myself. Ah, bang out of all the He nearly saved it though. Wait, we're both near this one. Yeah. Oh, that's I might fucking injure me if I do that. <laughs> Good. It's a bit tough. Getting up to speed with them. But we'll tech it. Tech it. Hardest preseason ever? Into yeah, just because it's getting back used to it, do you know what I mean? You've been out for a while. Obviously it's tough anyway. But then you even if the lads are there and you're there, you're still trying to get mm. back on track with them, do you know what I mean? So I'm doing alright though, I'm pleasantly surprised mate, so. In terms of like mentally as well. Because you've got that kind of target right in front of you. Do yeah. you feel you feel like quite motivated at the moment? Yeah. My an extra motivation is now is like obviously for myself, but then I also like when I see some of the lads obviously a little bit fit or whatever. Right, I need to get back back up to their level. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So yeah, it's that extra little bit. But we got target in mind. I'm still just taking it. Match day is 18th, 18th of July. But I've been in out for like a week or two now. Did stuff today, which was basically obviously the one, uh, the two v twos, three v twos, which is contact, mm. blocking shots, and things like that. So I might, if I can try and shave a week off, don't tell Keeps that because he'll have a go at me. But if I can try and shave a week off, I just need a few, uh, four weeks training with the lads. You know what I mean? Mm. To sharpness, I guess. Yeah, which you can't like. It's because you can do as much with Melv, Keeps, Jack. You can do as much running or this kind of stuff. But as soon as you get in there, it's a different ball game, isn't it? So. Mm. I just need to get in with them full time ASAP and then that'll every day get me back up to the level I need to be, eh? Mm. I'm feeling good, mate. Not in the gym anymore. Well, all the time anyway. No, thank God. Being in here every day is depressing. Um, we still have to do like, so today we'll have, uh, on Tuesday we had gym one, today we have gym two, like still different gym programs. But it's more like proprioception stuff. We've got a big day tomorrow, obviously, these are got a game, so we're doing. Um, like a big gym day, so we've got to mm. still keep the strength, but we've done most of the stuff building it back up now, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so yeah, mate. Dinner Haps must be good as well, like obviously been here together yeah. so long, you and Haps. Oh yeah. But uh, helping each other through. I think if I was doing that by myself, I would have struggled massively. Obviously it's hard anyway, but to have someone with you every day mm. makes it a lot easier. You can run, you know, just have a laugh with them. But yeah, it keeps you, keeps you going, you can get mm. each other through it, so. No, it's not good, but I'm, on one hand, I'm glad I've had Haps with me, obviously. I yeah. didn't want him to be injured, but at least I've had a, a little buddy with me. But we're close now, the light at the end of the tunnel. A couple more weeks. I'm back to scoring goals in League Two. Ah, uh, you know. I reckon I'll be probably get 10 15 this year coming, <laughs> so it should be a bad year for me.
Are you ready, Harsha, for your game? Ready, man. Come ready, on. yeah? You said it? Game, man. Yeah? Yeah, man. What's it like being with the first team? Huh? What's it like being with the first team? Yeah, it's good, it's good. It's better than youth team. Yeah? Why? Yeah. What's wrong with youth team? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just better, like, more strict. How's it better, though? Strict or... What's wrong, what's wrong with your team manager? Yeah. <laughs> nothing, nothing, nothing. Why? Right, mate. I told you he was coming. Welcome to the club. Yeah, it's good to, good to sign. Yeah, how long did you say? Four years. Yeah? The option. Well, yeah, Are you good? Yeah, I'm alright. Where would you come from? I um, come from the trenches. <laughs> <laughs> score prediction 4 0. Well, Shan, if you want the scores, I can give you the scores as well. Go on. Bonus point. So 4 0. We'll have one from. I said peace. One from Theo Archibald. Two from Paul Smith. And the, the last one. Could be a from set piece. Could be a set piece. George Monk. Okay. Agreeing with that? Yeah. Right now, I think it won't be a set piece. No, we don't want set pieces. We want who's the goal scorers, mate. Omar. Did you say Omar? No, no, no. What's the score going to be? 4 0, yeah. Don't copy. You can't have the same as me, mate. What's the question? What's the score? I think so. Yeah. Well, you think 4 0 as well? Yeah. Nah, eh, bad content in it. <laughs> <laughs> one one, one left, sharp, yeah? Yeah. No, Cooper. I don't know. Do you want us to run the best? Not do you. Really good first game signed. Um, nice to get a goal, and um, I think we've done well in the first half. So happy. Fitness wise, how was it? Uh, it was good. Good first test. Good to get a little run around, um, but I'm feeling good. Could have been that three or four first half, couldn't it? Yeah, I think I could add maybe another one or two, but um, you know that will come. I think. Um, but I think the team's done well. How was it tonight, mate? Yeah, it was good. I feel like I'm getting fitter. I still need to um, up it a bit more, but yeah, no, it was good. I enjoyed myself. Mm. Can close to a goal as well? Yeah, I should have scored. The, se the second one, keeper pulled out a worldie, so no, nah, but I had I had a lot of fun today. Mm. It's the first couple of weeks done now. Looking forward to Portugal? Yeah, looking forward to it. Buzzing for tomorrow. Just uh, hope for more of the same, just more opportunities and showing what I can do again. Good for you. Oh, come on, Zach, you need to get fit up. Come on. Come on, Tom. Come on, Tom. Push yourself. <laughs> Suicide run. How's that, son? It's good, mate. Little assist? Huh? Was it an assist? Yeah, I think so. Should have got done a bit more, but first going back. Oh. You have. Let me Hold on, that's that. Is that my design on Oh yeah, it would have been a worldies up. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, 
decent. Yeah. Well, that's professional golf for well, pre-season. They all count. But, yeah, all glory to God. How'd you find it tonight? Yeah, it was good. Good run out. It's the first of the season. Looking forward to it. Many more games. So get more minutes in the tank. Yeah, I mean, you look at that. We've, we've got no front players. Sonny's come on and done a good job for us. Um, but Drinan um, has got a dead leg from training two days ago. Um, Harry Smith got a tight calf in the warm-up. Ruel come off with a tight calf. We think that's something to do with the, the Astro Turf pitch. And then um, Paul Smyth just felt his hamstrings. So I thought I thought Paul Smyth was excellent in the time that he was on. So hopefully, you know, we'll, we won't, we'll be training more of a cool down when we get there in Portugal tomorrow after the, the long day's travelling and the recovery from today. So we hope that they'll be back fit and ready to train on Sunday.